Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'm going to take a look at the Blue Nexus Robotic Pool Cleaner by Sublue. This thing has some really high ratings. A lot of people have raved about it, so I wanted to take a look at it and share it with you. So let's take a look at the unit by itself. Good looking unit. It is cordless, so there's no tether cord, no power cords. It literally holds a charge for about four hours, I would say. So you could do a two and a half hour clean, no problem, and raise it right to the top. It's got these huge rubber tires right here, so you can grip the wall. It also has an extended tether cord right here, so this will go to the surface and communicate. So if you open this guy up right here, you'll see that there is a big cord in here that you can untangle, which you definitely want to do because this should be at the surface because this has an app which is cool so you can see what part of your pool has cleaned. It actually scans your pool. Pretty cool, I've never seen that before. So we're gonna take a look at this. We're gonna drop it in the pool. I'll talk about some of the features as I do that. So I'm just gonna unwind this all together and then I'll go ahead and turn it on, drop it in the pool. It's been about two weeks since I've cleaned this pool so it definitely needs it. So you're gonna be able to see some good cleaning. So what I'll do is I'll put the camera underwater so you can see how this works underwater and you can actually see how dirty it is. So let's go ahead and drop it in. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and just turn it on, hold the button down three seconds seconds and I'm going to select the mode that I want. There's all these different modes here and I'll give you a close-up of this. I'm going to do one that does the bottom of the pool and the sides because I want it to get really clean and I'm going to do uh, two and a half hours. Once I select that I'm going to go ahead and just tap it one time to turn it on and let's drop it in here. Let's see what it does. I would say weight. It's only about uh, maybe 25 pounds. Not too heavy. I do like that it has this because that'll keep it from flipping when it climbs walls. So it's already going under and starting to work here. So let's take a look underwater and see what it's doing. All right, let's get right into it. As you can see, I dropped him in the pool and he's already going to work. He's working so you don't have to. Makes your life a lot easier. And that's what this channel is all about, making your life easier. So let's talk about some of the features of this robot. It is cordless. You don't have to worry about cords. Plug into a house, two outlet, long extension cords. You don't have to worry about that. Holds a four hour charge. What pool can't be cleaned in four hours? It uses something called autonomous mapping. So what does that mean? Well, you'll notice in the very beginning when it started, when it first dropped it in the water, it would rotate around. What it's doing is it's scanning the entire pool, creating its own map, and then going on to an intelligent path planning. Pretty smart guys. This thing will clean every little inch of your pool because it scans it first. It uses those two cameras I talked about. It uses super suction, so you don't have to go right over something. You'll actually suck it in. I noticed that when I was cleaning and I was filming it, it was just pulling in dirt and debris if it just came near it. I thought that was pretty impressive. It does have five cleaning modes, as I mentioned, suitable for all types of pools, whether it's above ground or below ground. It uses a safe lithium ion battery so you can actually swim while it is cleaning, which is great. Large capacity filter chamber, which we'll show you later when we open it up and check it out. It does use a smart app, like I mentioned before, and it does remote upgrades OTA, so over the air. Their whole idea is no tangled cords, no restricted movements. They want to make pool cleaning easy, and that's exactly what they did. One thing I noticed about it is it boosts a 100 watt high performance suction motor. So it, it's a really high powerful motor, especially for a cordless robot. I was really impressed with it. As you can see, it's just cruising around, picking up everything. This pool is going to be so clean when I'm done. I am so excited to see how it does. All right, so I've got him in the pool, as you can tell right here. It's been going for a few minutes. I'm going to go to lunch. That's the beauty of having a pool robot is that it does the work for you so you don't have to. I'm going to go to lunch for about an hour. I'll come back. We'll see what kind of progress we're doing. I can already tell that this side of the pool is actually pretty clean and he's working his way over here. It's going to be a lot of fun to see what the results are. So uh, we'll check back later. All right, here we are. We're about two hours in. The sun's starting to set. So we're going to pull this guy out. We're going to look at all the features of this robot. There's some things I wanted to talk about, some cool things that this has that I've never seen in a pool robot. And we'll also look at the pool and see how it did. I can tell just from my eyes, the thing is spotless. I'm really impressed with this robot. So let's pull him out and take a look. All 
All right, so I know I talked about most of the features of this while it was in the pool and I was showing you some of the underwater filming scenes, but I just wanted to show you really quick some of the cool things. So it does have this really good grab handle where you would use your hook and just literally slide it right in and lift it right out. Uh, so it does have that very nice. Now, one thing you'll notice right here on the front, there is a sensor. Now, you'll notice that in the video, the first thing it did was it spun around. What it's doing, is this proprietary, guys. This is, this is serious technology. What it's doing is it's scanning your pool. It's looking at the shape of your pool because this will work with any shape, whether it's rectangular, oval, bean, whatever kind of pool you have. I have a very unique shaped pool right here and it scanned it so it made sure that it hit every inch of your pool in its cycle. So that's pretty cool. And underneath here, you will notice a few things here. So it's got these really good rubber grips right here. This is great for buffing the side of your pool because you'll notice in some of the scenes, it was climbing the side of the pool and it was buffing. Now I will tell you, there's one thing about this pool robot compared to some commercial pool robots doesn't do well with steps. So if you have a lot of steps, I've got a tremendous amount of steps here. So what I would do is I would brush off the steps, then throw him in here. He'll do the sides of the pool, he'll do the bottom of the pool. But climbing steps is always a challenge with pool robots. Most pools only have a few steps here and there. So mine's a little bit unique in this particular pool, but it doesn't take much to take your brush and just brush off the, the steps right before you throw him in there. He picks up everything, even that fine dust. You'll notice there was a lot of brown sand-like stuff at the bottom of my pool. It's because I have a well here and it's iron and it clumps together with the chemicals we put in it. It drops to the bottom. It sinks to the bottom. Normally you'd have to vacuum it out once every couple weeks. You have a robot like this, you just toss him in there for a couple hours, lay by the pool, don't stress. You could even swim when he's in there, which is pretty cool. So he can do all the work for you. You don't have to worry about it. Under here, this is where it sucks it in right here. It's got a high power suction. Really impressed with the suction on this thing. You could actually see in the video, all of that dirt and sand kind of just attract to this. It sucked it into this. It was really pretty impressive. So there's also sensors on the side here, right here. Um, so it has kind of an all around sensor situation here, which is pretty nice. But here's the true test right here. So what did it do as far as picking up? So I'm curious myself how good it did. You knew the pool just from the video I showed you in the beginning was pretty dirty. It had been a couple weeks. We had a couple bad storms. So let's see how we did. Oh my gosh. Can you see all that in there? That is gross. So how do you clean it? There's a little push button right here. You just push it and lift that off and then you would just hose it out. But there is grass in there and we mowed and obviously some of the grass got in here. Um, yeah, so I will definitely be cleaning that out really quick here. Um, yeah, so anyways, it obviously works because that was pretty disgusting. I like the rubber wheels. The panel's really nice. There is an app also, which I'm not gonna get too much into the app, but it is nice because you can see what part of your pool has already been done. You can also set your, it to do certain things to your pool. So if you noticed when you come out that the sides maybe aren't buffed good enough, you could just have it do the sides and it will just do the sides all the way around. Pretty nice. Um, and like I mentioned before, you do have your little plug right here, and this is where this little buoy goes. And this is great because it keeps it from flipping over. Also has some commu communication there as well. And then right below it is where you're going to charge it. So once this dries up, you would pull that out and charge it up. It holds about four hours of charge. And the largest uh, time on here is two and a half hours, so you shouldn't run out. Uh, unless you run it twice and then you just use your pole and pull it right out and charge it back up. So no cords other than the little buoy here, which is super important. Uh, there's a lot of pool robots I've done on this channel that don't have buoys and they will try to climb a wall and they'll flip over and then what good is it? So to be honest with you, I'm actually really impressed with this thing for the price point. This is a mid-range price point. I'll put the price down in the description section of this video where you can get this. It is a brand new product. So I believe at least at the time of this video, it's pre-order only. They're only shipping a limited amount of these. So um, make sure you get in on this if you want to. Guys, I'm getting older and I've got a family. It's a lot of work to maintain a pool. With something like this, it does all the work for you. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you're new to my channel, please do subscribe. Thanks again, everybody. Bye.